I'm going to take a quick look at a nested array, also known as a multidimensional array, so that I can access its values. Now this is JavaScript, and what I have up top here is an array, and then right below it, I'm alerting out the value that it's grabbed. So what we're looking at here, that pop-up, is the number six. So this is the alert window. That's what I called down here alert and it looks inside of the items array that I created up here and first it asks for the array at index 2 so here are the sub arrays and there's three of them and wrapped inside this opening right here bracket and closing bracket that opening and closing bracket is the I guess you would say parent array container and inside of that is your sub arrays or your child arrays and that's these three okay. they start at zero. So the index for this first subarray is zero. For the second, it's one. The third is two. So it asks in index two of the items array. So that'd be one, zero, excuse me, one, two, right here. In there, Get me the value at index one. Inside of this array is this array here, the values for the array. That starts at zero. Zero, one. So six. And that's what it returns in the window. So I'm going to go ahead and Place it back in, and we'll see six right up here. I can try a different combination. And so here I'll go ahead and grab the value two, and that's in the first index. Again, the index starts at zero, so zero. And since the index also starts at zero for the subarray. It went to zero, and then one, which is two. That's the value that's in index one, and that's what pops up in the window here. I can do the middle one. So I would do one, and I'll grab that three value. Right now, I'll grab that four because this is index one inside of that array but if I wanted to grab the three I'll do zero and there it is three. so that's how we access the values in the uh, nested or uh, as we might also know a multi-dimensional array